Making mistakes was part of learning, no matter how talented you were. Once more, she had better mastery of fire this time. But wait, disaster was about to happen. Thankfully, her father intervened in time. Yeah, fire is dangerous. But we'll get there eventually. Let's see if we can do something in Ben's workshop. We've uh, upgraded our little crit, as promised. See, swiftness is not something we actually need still. I'll argue that we don't. Uh, Obelisk Remembers is great, but these two are where it's at, right? So I'm going to increase damage. Nope, can't afford that. Can't afford any of those, actually. Except movement speed. It is tempting to just upgrade something while we can. Um, you know what? Just let's, let's just do it. Maybe we'll get an achievement out of it or something. So then, we've got... What's with the arrow down there? Right, there the go. goblin bandits had been preying on Anaya Dias pilgrims with unprecedented cruelty. Removing the evil would help those who had taken refuge in the caves. Ben had heard that the goblin sibling's lair was somewhere in the lost trenches of Berkson's had to deal with those two as soon as they could. I know father is going to have a good plan to get past that pair of goblins. All right, it's John's turn today, I think. I think John's my least favorite, but we uh, should keep upgrading all the characters in tandem because they have family abilities that benefit the entire family. And he swings his sword back and forth, he swings his sword back and forth. There is something about there just being a bit more difficult just in the beginning as well when you start with a, a new character and so on. Right, there we go. Who's summoning all of these, then? Oh, that's what he summons instead of Acid and Frost. That's what. The bastard. Oh, hello. Why is this slow, John? Alright, so he doesn't regenerate his energy while blocking. That's what the deal is with John. Oh, I like. I actually missed that one. Amateur hour. Not great. Do I do more damage while I'm not blocking? Jesus, the shield is nothing. Right. Still 13 to 21 here as well. So what's with the yellow? Is that just an indicator of how much HP I have left? Could be. Obelisk de la Skill. Alright, definitely gonna die soon. Not great. Alright, so they get stun locked at least. That's something. So it's the same room then, is it? We get a different different character? Ah! Uh, Alright, let's just find out sooner rather than later. Alright, so it's the same kind of challenge. Just with a different reward. Not sure what kind of reward we're getting this time though, but we'll find out. Ooh, I got some health back. Now the question is, was that because we leveled up? Or was it just, oh, because we were lucky and got a drop? Jesus Christ. I'm dead. I'm so dead. 
Oh, here we go. Oh my. Come on, drop some health, please. No. There we go. All right, you guys, you're almost dead. That's fine. Got two HP. Please, please. Let me just stay alive for a bit longer. There we go. He's going to shoot soon. There it is. Now he's summoning. Let's just kill it. Stay alive. Oh, bad. Bad, bad, bad. No! Oh, I just got him though. Or did I? Hmm. Okay, now we know it's the same challenge every time. Um, and John's terrible. When training and sparring war on the mind, the occasional game of ball between father and son could be the ideal break. The game of ball. So, if we get one of these every time we die, how long is going to be? How long is it going to be before they start looping? Let's jump straight back in, John. Oh my god, so many enemies. Eighteen to be exact. Right, so one thing I do like about John is his wide reach of the sword. But uh, that's pretty much it. I'm not a big fan. I'm actually looking forward to the next one where we play Linda again. I'm missing that lady. Right, here we go. Oh no. Nuts. Ah, uh, is our frost mage? Oh my. No. There we go. Oh, don't freeze me, bro. Oh my god, I'm dead already. Ugh. Horrible. Right. Arches. Jesus. What's that? Lifelong pal, heals a portion of your life once in a while. Please heal all of the portions, all of the while. Right, what's beyond the barrier? Please be a puzzle, not a challenge room. Can Good. your body endure the mind's gamble? So I've done this one once, and then I just stepped on the middle one, and that was, I don't know, correct? Or is it just like a receive random reward? Okay, I'll take it. Money and health, that's what we want. You there, you're terrible, I hate you. All right, let's go south. Let's go way down south, see what we can find way down south. Oh, hello. Come on, friend. Heal me. It's been a while now, so heal me every once in a while. Right? Some sort of Triforce on the floor. There we go. We got Gift of Life. Increased maximum health. Which is uh, good. Oh, hello. Zap. I kind of want to increase the damage that one does. The, uh, the lightning. Let's see, do we have skill points? Yes, we do have skill points. Let's uh, let's do that then. There we go. Uh, ooh, what's uh, what's his family skill? Of the same blood. Increase the max health of all family members. See, playing with John does pay off, but is not by far my favorite character to play with. What have we got? 
Vitality. Um, I never read the Vitality one, is it? More health for a small duration? Could be. Ah, crap. That's... There we go, I've got health. That's something. Let's not knock the purple flower and blast ourselves to death like we did with poor Kevin. Uh, here we go, we've got the finish room. Which means we hopefully get an item of value. Oh, hello. Heaven's justice, divine relic. Call forth a sword of the divine to damage enemies. That's sweet. Question then is, do we exhaust the level? Or do we just venture on? I say we'll venture on this time. Lost trenches two out of three. Hmm. Mammoths. Mammoth graveyard. Oh, could be an elephant, of course. Nothing in the corpse. Bit creepy that you're looking through the corpse. The stuff. Oh, come on. Just bloody die already. There we are. We've got some archers over here. And the crossbowmen. That's what they're called. Alright. Not sure my little companion is healing me as much as I want, but... Hopefully it's doing something, all right. Every once in a while. Hey. Okay, come on. Ah, that's getting on my nerves. All right. Break open the pot. All right. Collect the money then. Let's see. There's an obelisk down here, I think. Which there's probably also a bunch of enemies. Obelisk of fortune. So much fortune. Right. Up to the northwest. Oop. Ow. And then I just walked straight into it, didn't I? Thought that was a good idea. Right. Let's run in here. Do a little blast. Shit. Oh my god, taking all of the damage. All of the time. Oh, taking all of the arrows in the back as well. <sighs> okay, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. <sighs> there we go. The lightning strike is back. For an easy kill. Now please heal me, companion. Increase critical hit chance. Come on, crit then. Bastards. Wait, I haven't tried to use the... Oh. Used to be close. All right. I have to say, I haven't used the Heavenly Sword yet. But now, I am. All right. Uh, I did see something up here. What have we got? Ooh, okay, so you have to switch Totem of Rostam. Create a totem that greatly buffs you. Call forth the Sword of the Divine to, de to damage enemies. Uh, uh, think I might. Think. Oh, I kind of want to hang on to the. I kind of want to hang on to the Heaven's Justice. Um, hmm, but I guess we should try, right? We could always switch back and forth. Create a totem that greatly buffs you. Let's uh, let's just try it. Oh, okay, so it buffs me within this area. No idea how much it buffs me, right? 
quite a long cooldown. Oh, actually gives me more health, right. Quite right. Uh, right, let's hang on to it then. Hey guys. This way. Please. Good, right. Definitely need more health. Mastery. Uh, yeah, okay, we're gonna have to look at that codex to see what these things do because I definitely don't have time to stop and read them when I'm picking them up. Okay, all of those archers, I want them to die, please. Pretty please, with sugar on the top. Good, you died, you listened to me. Mastery... doesn't seem to do more damage. Maybe slightly, maybe just a couple of points. Whoa! There we go, we've got the buff going again. And I'll do that in the completely wrong area. Okay. I'm gonna die. Why is that guy not dying though? Jesus. Seriously, his health bar didn't go down. Is he protected by something? Must be. Oh well, I think that's it for John. Thank you so much for watching this episode, and if you uh, like this video, click like below, leave comments, and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys next week for some more Children of Mortar.